Hi everyone, so as always there's a new update for iOS 16 and on the maps you can now add in a stop so you don't have to go from A to B, you can put in stops and you can move them around. I'm going to show you that just in a moment. So I am here, I am at Mile End and I want to go to Liverpool Street but at the same time I may want to just stop somewhere else and perhaps let's stop at St Paul's Cathedral on the way and I'll show you how to do that and how you can adjust it as well. So as you can see, I'm by Regent's Canal, by Mile End Park, it's just lovely here. But as I said, I want to go to Liverpool Street Station. So let's just type that in and you know you can type in an address or something like that, or a location, landmark, and there it is. Now, I probably wouldn't be driving it, but it's showing me over here that it would take me 20 minutes. I'd probably be better off going on public transport. So I'm going to tap on that for the directions and you can see here I can add a stop so let's just put that in let's put in St Paul's Cathedral and there it is it comes up here and it's now showing me the route but you might want to change this around a bit so I want to go to St Paul's Cathedral first and you've got these three little lines next to it and I can just tap and hold and drag to move it around and it will now show me that new route and I can move that back because that looks like a more better route to go on and I could add in other stops as well so if I wanted to I did see Fortnum and Mason pop up here let's just choose that one and that's going to come up it's loading there we go and again I maybe would want to do this order here St Paul's then Fortnum and Mason and then onto Liverpool Street Station. So I can keep adding more stops if I want, which is really quite useful. Other things that you might want to know about the maps is down the bottom here. You can choose how you're going to get there, drive, walk, transit. Transit is probably a better option for this. And it will show me that and it tells me down the bottom the route. So it's telling me the central line. And I can tell it when I want to leave as well. So maybe I want to do this on Friday and I can tell it that I want to do it, say, 20 past nine in the morning, and or and then I can tap on done. Down at the bottom here, it does say leave now, which would then set now for this time. Let's just hit done, it's gonna show me, and then if I tap on prefer, it, you can choose how you want to do it. I probably wouldn't be going by ferry, and it probably wouldn't be giving me that option. So this is the preferences for what mode of transport you'd want to use if you're using public transport. So just going back here, what do you want to do if you want to remove one of these stops? Slide it across to the left, tap delete, and it's done. It will recalculate it for you. I hope that was useful. If you do like this, please do like, share and subscribe and come back for more. I've got lots of videos on my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching and take care.